cannot wrap my head around the fact that it's taken me this long to finally realize I'm fantastic. I used to write my little raps, they always look right past it, like it's average, like I'm not with the fuck. Hey you guys, it's your girl Cootie, back with another shopping haul. So let's start with these three belts right here. This is from the local fashion store that I sometimes go to. And it is like a fake um, Gucci. This one too. Or could be like Chanel. And this one's a fake Givenchy. You know, style it up your or accessorize your outfit. You know, look stylish. So this one right here is a Gucci sunglasses that I bought two weeks ago. It's so beautiful. It's so cute. I really adored it. I don't really wear this type of shade of sunglasses, but you know, it worked out for me. So I got this um, Christian Dior bucket hat that I got almost a month ago, and I got this one over a month ago, like two weeks before, you know, I got this one. And then I just got this one today, a TJ Maxx um, polo shirt that looks kind of like the Christian Dior shirt. Instead of me spending hundreds of dollars for just a shirt, I got this for what? 32 dollars. And I found these Christian Dior dupe from Didi's for only $4.49. You know what? I was like, ain't nobody gonna tell. Ain't not gonna know, you know? Style it up. This was also another find from Didi's yesterday for $3.99. It's a waist belt that looks like Chanel. And then I found this from Forever 21 about two weeks ago. And it looks like a fake Dolce & Gabbana, you know. So Here on to the next one is this fake Burberry shirt that I got from Burlington for only $9.99. And then this skirt from this fashion store that I go to. And it's so cute. It was given. I wanted to pair it up and then it kind of didn't look cute together. <laughs> right. And then I also got this from the local fashion store. It looks like the Tiffany & Co. earrings. And then I got this from Ross. The Tommy Hill figure belt. They kind of look like the Hermes belt. And then I found this belt that looks like Gucci from the local fashion store. Even the cashier was like, oh, we sell this? Then I found this perfume from Dee Dee's. Mom. Cherie, Coco Mam de Maisel, Chanel Paris. It's a perfume and it's like a dupe of it. So it's like a kind of like a little bit of the same scent, but I haven't opened it and I hope it does smell like it. And I think I showed you guys this one, but I just wanted to match it with the pants that I got from Dee Dee's for only $3.99. It was so adorable. I wanted to pants, I mean, pair it up with this jogger pants and then, or I could switch it up with this one from Guess. It's a Guess um, knit um, tank top. So I can match it with this cute purse. It's a U.S. Polo Assist Association bag. I never really buy those bags. So yes, you know. I don't have much um, purses from U.S. Polo Association. I think this was my first one. And then, you know, it was giving um, Louis Vuitton vibes. And I did see the uh, from the other DDs that it, there was one like this, but it was a wallet. The reason why this purse caught my eyes is because of the shape of it. And also, it does kind of look like the Louis Vuitton um, print, but just a little different. But I just love the color, and I wanted to match it with the jogger pants in this top that i already been having. And it gave me that 2009 to 2012 vibes of the shape of the purse. Because I was, like, looking for purses like this now. And it's like, you know what? I love this shape and I've been looking through online and they're like too pricey like 30 bucks 40 bucks and then that's still cheap but you know it's still like it's not giving you know it needs a little bit more style to it thank you come again